Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to perform the another lab of generative AI. So we'll start the lab fastly. Yes, we got the credential now. Copy this password. Uh, right click on open cloud console and open it in incognito window. Click on next. Paste that part, password and hit enter. Click on I understand. Click on this checkbox and click on I am going to come back to the lab instruction. Come on to task number one. Now we have to create the API key. So for this, go to the API and services then go to the credentials click on create credentials and click on API keys it will generate the API key for you I will recommend you to use the notepad to copy this uh, API key so copy this API key from here come to the notepad and paste it so we have done with the task number one click on check my progress now we have to export it on the cloud shell so copy this come back to the app instructions or cloud shell click on this the cloud shell click on continue So, so. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are going to perform the another lab of generative AI. So we'll quickly start the lab. Uh, by clicking the start lab uh, we got the credential now copy this password right click on open cloud console and in opening incognito window paste that password uh, click on next click on I understand Click on checkbox and click on again continue. Open the cloud shell from here. Come back to the lab instruction. Okay, click on continue first. Come back to the lab instruction. Go to the task number one. So here we have to create the one API key. For this, come back to the cloud shell, cloud console, and then go to the API and services, then go to the credentials. Uh, now click on the create credential and then API key. It will generate one API key. Uh, please use the uh, notepad to save that API key. Copy this, come back to the notepad and save. Close this. Click on check my progress. You will get this. Now we have to export that into the cloud shell. So copy this, come to the cloud console and Let's start command key. Now we have to edit this command. So remove the text till the equal to sign and then copy this API key. Paste it. So we have done with this now. Uh, now we have to uh, create the bucket. So copy this bucket name carefully till this full stop. Before this full stop, come back to the cloud console. Then Search here for the buckets. Open it in a new tab. Click 
click on create paste the name make sure there is no white space after the project click on continue or then click on continue again click on continue now here uh, we have to untick this post public access and click on the find click on continue and then create come back to the login sessions so we have done with this now we have to upload this image on the bucket so copy the name of the image right click on image click on save image as remove this name paste it and hit enter now we have to upload this on the bucket and have to add one entry of a public so we do this so here click on upload files upload that image here see it's uploaded if we refresh now it's gone so click for the edit access we have to click on this uh, three dots then click on edit access uh, click on add entry and select the public from here click on save so we have done with this let's come back have instruction click on check now progress you will be successful done so now we have to create one uh, request.json file so copy this file name come to the cloud console then go to the first tab and here you have to write the nano and space then paste that file hit enter so it will open that request.json file now we have to edit this code okay we have to replace the bucket name here so copy this come to the notepad first or you can remove this paste that code or click here remove this all this come to the cloud console or in the second tab then copy this name bucket name come to the notepad again and paste here here okay so copy this everything come to the tab first tab um, paste that code okay so we have done with this now control x normal y and hit enter to save this file so we have done this okay now we have to label it uh, Level detection. Uh, in this, we have to call the Cloud Fusion API. For this, copy this command, come to the Cloud Console, uh, paste it command, and hit enter. We have done with this. Okay, now we have to change the type uh, to the web detection. So, copy this web detection carefully. Come to the Cloud Shell. Now, again, open that file by nano. Now we have to change this type. Use the arrow keys to move in these file. So come here, remove this. This web detection. For saving, uh, click Ctrl X Y and hit enter. So we have done with this changes. Copy this command now. Come back to the cloud shell. Paste and hit enter. Back to the lab instructions again. We need to do this. Yes, now we have to upload the new image. So for this, copy this image name. Do not copy that full stop. Uh, right click on the image, click on save images. Uh, rename this file. Hit enter. Okay. And also we have to public it. So come to the cloud shell. Uh, go to the tab 2 or oh, now click on upload files now select that image and upload it it's uploading yes it's done now we have to click on three dots of here or uh, three dots of a selfie.png click here click on edit access uh, we have to add one more entry it's public select public and click on save so we have done with this click on check my progress you will be now we have to again up update the file okay, we also add to another another type that is fifth so copy this come to the notepad remove this all just that we have to replace the pocket name here so come back to the cloud shell and copy this pocket name again 
come to the notepad click this click done so copy this code now come to the first tab and in the cloud share type nano and that file name it was Now we have to remove this all. Remove this all. Click so, the black space to remove it. Now paste that code. And now click on Control X. Try and hit enter. Save the file. So we have done with this now. We have to call the Vision API again. So copy this command from the cloud shell and run this command. We have done with this now. We have to upload the another image. So copy this image name. Uh, right click on this image, click on save images, rename it with the name city.png and hit enter. Uh, again we have to upload it in the bucket. So come to the bucket. Uh, which is in the second app and now click on upload files now upload that image again we have to uh, edit access with the copy okay so here is that file so click click on three dots of city.png now click on edit access now add another entry of the copy select click from here click on save so we have done with this now Come to the lab instruction, click on check now properties, you will get this one. No need to perform the next task uh, because it doesn't have any check now properties. So you are good to go. Click on end lab, you will get this one. Click on submit. Yes. We'll check if we get this code or not. Yes, we have got the copy. So thank you for watching. We'll meet in the next one.